The first recipient of the Engineering Medal for Research and Development is Dr. Ashraf Aldamadi. So I was inspired for engineering uh, since I was a little, little kid uh, by the virtues that I liked math and physics. I was always fascinated by cars, by buildings, by structures. My area of research is structural engineering. I focus on two aspects, looking for the resilience of structures, mainly uh, due to natural disaster effects. The second focus is mainly how can we develop computer tools to be able to predict the performance of structures, optimize the design of structures, and design structures that are more sustainable. We cannot prevent natural disasters from happening, but we can try to adapt to natural disasters and become more resilient. We can design structures to resist uh, what we call gravity loads, the weight of the building or people live in the building. But lateral loads comes from, from earthquake and wind are much more challenging. I couldn't have done anything without my graduate students. I have a big group of about 15 people working with me on transmission line structures under the effect of uh, tornadoes and downburst. We looked into try to understand this wind field. First research to be done in the world on this subject from engineering point of view a lot of testing, and we try to figure out how can we design structures to resist that. I think our research, it helps, it contributes to improving people's quality of life, preventing uh, devastating failures that could happen to water tanks, to bridges, to low-rise uh, building houses. I'm lucky that my job involves uh, research, teaching, administration, consulting, and I like all of them. The robot itself interfere with the wind. But the part that I'm pleased about is, is research. Engineering, it's, it's a great career. It's a highly regarded study and discipline because of the analytical skills that you develop while studying it. It's a great service for the community and for the society. We cannot live without engineers. I think my advice is, is hard work. Maintain your, your high ethical standards and don't compromise that. I received this email uh, that I won this award. The thing that came to my mind once I got this, uh, this email is when I arrived to Canada, coming from Egypt. My hope at that time, I was dreaming to get a PhD and to become a member of the PO. And now, after 27 years, I'm getting an award and recognized by the PO. And the thing that came to my mind, uh, it's a great country. We, are, we live in a great country. To recognize his groundbreaking and innovative achievements in wind engineering, engineer Ashraf Aldamadi is being honored with the Engineering Medal in the Research and Development category.